Today, we're going to learn about stress. Stress is the state of mental tension and worry caused by problems in your life. Stress is something that causes strong feelings of worry and anxiety. So what does stress look like? Imagine that this is your body and this is stress. If I pour this liquid, which is the stress, into the body, the body can handle it, right? And that's a good thing because a certain amount of stress gives you the adrenaline to be able to perform better in school, in sports, or maybe even in a test. Sometimes though, the stress is a little bit more than what we can handle. And we begin to feel tense and we don't feel right. Imagine if the amount of stress is so much that it is like pouring all of this liquid into the glass. The body simply cannot handle it. That's what chronic stress looks like. Now let's talk a little bit about what the stress response is. To understand the stress response, think of your brain as a house. It has a downstairs and an upstairs. In the downstairs is where things like fear and worry hang out. In the upstairs is where we can make good decisions and have better self-control and manage our emotions in a productive way. Imagine that you run across this guy. So the first thing that's gonna happen is your body is going to go into alarm mode. And that's a really good thing because it's going to allow you to do three things, fight, flight, or freeze. What happens is your downstairs brain activates and it, it, that allows you to be able to react. Your upstairs brain shuts down. So you're not really thinking very much. After a while, if you keep walking and the bear goes away, then you can begin to calm down, take a deep breath, and relax. But sometimes, the amount of stress is so much that that alarm system stays on. Imagine. Trying to study, trying to pay attention, trying to make good decisions while that alarm system is active. 